do people love the Blu-ray collection videos so much, like so much more than any other? Like, what is the thrill of people going? I have. I don't this. know. Yeah. I just never understood. It. I've only did those videos because they people, get views. People, no, because people ask, and then they get, they got so many views. I was like, why? It's a show and tell. That's all it is. I have this. I have this. I have this. And like, did you, did you love show and tell back in like elementary school? Don't. Why do you think that everyone likes watching these Blu-ray collection videos so much? I don't know, cause they, uh, it'll give people ideas on what they should add to theirs, or maybe you know, they'll give us insight on what we should add to ours, or maybe they'll just tell us we're fucking stupid. We're gonna be showing you guys Dalton's entire Blu-ray collection. It's not the most impressive. All right, before we start uh, getting into the movies, um. Could you put a freaking shirt on, please? Why? Because, like, I, I, I don't want everyone staring into your freaking tits and belly. How's that? The first movies we're gonna be talking about are the three movies that he got on Black Friday because we didn't show off any of our pickups. So the first film we got is Forrest Gump, one of my all-time favorite movies, my fourth favorite to be exact. Some people say it's a sad movie, some people say it's a funny movie, I don't know. I just think it's a, it's a movie you can watch it with the family, it's not gonna offend people. Leonardo DiCaprio and Tom Hardy in The Revenant. AKA movie that I bought a few years ago and then Dalton threw out the window. Flashback? Fla yeah, I'm not gonna, I'm, to say. I'm not gonna show it again. John Wick? Featuring Keanu Reeves, one of the most fucking badass actors, I think. That movie just makes him to seem like he is such a badass. Me and my girlfriend watched that. When his dog died in the beginning, she got like super upset. Then they hit him with the baseball bat and all that. And she's like, I thought he was supposed to be a badass. I was like, but wait, there's more. John Wick? And he's like, yeah, you know him? He's like, yeah, I know him. He's the boogeyman killer. You know, then it goes all to hell from there. He fucking kills everybody. Can't wait to pick up John Wick 2 and John Wick 3 Parabellum. Oh, labels badass. We're shooting the entire Blu-ray collection. You're not giving it Away, and why are you gonna sell a single motherfucking one? <laughs> when I get back, Dalton and I'm not kidding either. Look at me. What? I'm being so serious. They want to look at them. <laughs> what the? <laughs> <laughs> Next up, two films you got in the second video you were in back Robo in the day. Cop. Robocop. Unrated, Unrated director's, director's cut, cut, bitches! Ah, uh, Taken. We actually bought this in uh, the mall video, the one where we got kicked out of the mall. We just, yep. we just didn't show off our pickups. Yeah, because I was severely pissed. That is one of the best Dalton videos. I love that. The X-Files. Fifty Shades of Grey and Fifty Shades Darker. Steelbook. You know, when I want to have sex, I watch these. Because it gets my lady in the mood and it gets me in the mood, you know, so. The Twilight Saga 5 movie collection. I assume your uh, girlfriend, like, got this or made you get it? Why can't I like that movie? I love those movies. I bought them, yes. War the Millers, a film that I actually really like. Yeah, it's kind of a crappy modern day comedy, but I like it. Jennifer Aniston, she's just fucking hotter than shit. So. Dirty Grandpa. Fucking hilarious film. Speaking of hilarious films, Zombieland. Uh, definitely in my top 20 favorite comedies. I love this movie. Very creative movie in terms of writing. I wouldn't say overall the movie's creative, even though I just did. But elements of it are, like the editing, the rules come up and stuff like that. Another creative aspect of that Zombieland movie I liked was they didn't just give people plain Jane names like Mark, Zach, Lucy, and Tammy, you know? It was like Tallahassee, Columbus. Little Rock, all-time favorite of mine. Yes, it's one of my all-time favorites. Django and Chain. It's got some of my favorite actors, uh, Jamie Foxx, Leonardo DiCaprio. It's my third favorite Tarantino. I think Pulp Fiction and Reservoir Dogs are better. Another Django Unchained. We got this in, a, in, in an Alex Leiva video as well. Yes, I did. You ever watch The Hateful Eight again? You know that was a, a one-room movie, The yeah. Hateful Eight was? I just he, thought that was pretty cool. Yeah, yeah, I love movies that take place all in one location. You don't see a lot of movies that do that anymore, you know what I mean? If you have a film that takes place all in one location, you gotta have have a great script. It takes a lot of skill to make a one location movie work. Law Abiding Citizen, this movie, I love it because it, it takes me into a, a perspective that I could see myself doing where if something happened to my family and I didn't think I got the justice I deserved, I'd go out and do the 
crazy heinous acts that the movie shows. Pulp Fiction, one of my favorite movies. If you haven't seen this and you're a movie enthusiast, then you should jump off a bridge. Age of Ultron. I don't like that movie at all. I don't like you hardly at all. Reservoir Dogs, one of my all-time favorite movies. I, I love everything about it. Suicide Squad, a straight out of Captain. Crazy motherfucker named Ice Cube. Fast Five, Fast Four, Fast Two. I like them all, so I bought them all. Swing Vote, I watched this in a government class in high school my senior year. It's the only reason uh, I bought it. <laughs> a train wreck, little fuckers. Fuckers. No. Central, not so intelligent. I, I think you picked this up in the first Jocelyn video. Kong Skull Island. I like all the King Kong movies. I think King Kong is a fucking badass. The 2005 King Kong is actually one of my favorite movies. Another film that you picked up in that first uh, Jocelyn video the night before. Conjuring and Conjuring 2. No. Jeepers Creepers 1 and 2. Double Jeepers Pack. Creeper. Ted 2, an okay sequel. I don't know. It's fine. 22 Jump Street. Steel Book. I like it. I always like, uh, you know, really self-aware flicks like this. Super Troopers 1 and 2 Steelbook. Into the Woods. Fant Four Stick. The Hunger Games Catching Fire. Was it pretty fire doll in there? No. It was pretty fire. Duck Dynasty Season 3. Never seen the show. Vacation. Uh, the 2015 version. I heard it was garbage. You heard wrong. It's a pretty great movie. Percy Jackson, The Sea of Monsters. Patriot's Day. Valkyrie. Assassin's Creed. Return of the Jedi. Steelbook. Guys, I'm so sorry if this video is like not in focus at all. Kings in the Secret Service. We talked about this quite a bit in the videos. Baby Driver. Another Alex Leiba video Dalton was in. Kevin Spacey's like, like last like movie. I know someone's gonna be like, no, Leiba, he was in this and then this. But yeah, like those were probably like small piece of crap movies. This is his last legitimate movie. Almost was all, all the money in the world, but and I'd say he kind of went out with a bang. Decent last film for good Kevin Spacey. Rest in peace, Kevin Spacey's career. Grown ups, overrated, not that funny, except when uh, Kevin James's fat ass slams into a tree and falls down. That was pretty funny, but that's it. The original miniseries, Paul Flores would be very happy to see that Dalton owns this. And it's even got lenticular slipcover. St. Vincent, I haven't seen it, but Dalton recommended it to me. Melissa McCarthy, a wonderful actress. San Andreas, Kingsman 2, The Golden Circle. Love it, can't get enough. Of it. Holiday Nights, The Ballad of Ricky Bobby. Logan. Okay film. Deadpool and Deadpool 2. Deadpool 1 is so much better than Deadpool 2 in my opinion. Grab your man berries. Examine your bag of beans. Get familiar. Feel for changes. It's fucking cool as shit. Endgame Steelbook, or excuse me, Ender's Game, The Gunman, National Lampoon's Christmas Vacation, one of my favorite uh, Christmas movies for sure, very funny, Monuments Men, Dirty Dancing, Anchorman 2 Pack, with Anchorman 2 only, Thor The Dark World, the worst MCU movie, Fast and Furious Steelbook, Limited Edition Pussies, Friday, Fate of the Furious, The Interview, Organize Your Collection, Fast and Furious Six. Right Along 2, Transformers Dark of the Moon, uh, this isn't a steelbook, this is a metal pack. Last but not least, if you guys have watched me here from the start, and if y'all can't tell, I'm a fan of uh, war movies. War movies is your uh, favorite genre, right Dalton? This is my favorite movie, Fury featuring Brad Pitt. I fucking love it. I love historically accurate movies and that movie is, you know, it's pretty historical and it's, you know, decently accurate, so. Uh, when I first seen it, I fell in love with it, and I loved it ever since. I mean, it's nowhere near as bad as, you know, something like Malachi to where Tusk is his favorite movie of all time. <laughs> and then he tells that to Edward Furlong? Yeah, yeah, he said it right to John Connor's face that he thinks that Tusk is better than Terminator 2. And then, like, in the video, he goes, Yep, mm-hmm, yep, that's what I did. <laughs> yep, mm-hmm, that's what I did. And that was Dolan's Blu-ray collection. What do you have to say, bro? Uh, I hope everybody enjoyed it. I know it's not the most impressive, but uh, in the video, leave me comments of what I should add to it, what I should take away from it, and I'll take everything into in, into consideration. You know, honestly, like, I would much rather do uh, How to Be a Hillbilly Part 2, you know, than do a Dalton's entire Blu-ray collection. I'm going to organize my movies in here now by alphabetical order. Dude, why not by genre? Do it by genre. Alphabetical order. Alright people, I'm gonna do it by alphabetical order right now, but if that really upsets you, me doing it by alphabetical order, 
You better like and subscribe and tell Labo that you want to see it in genre and I will put it in genre for you and then we'll shoot a little video showing you how I did it. D-E-U-L-E-R-1-1. -E -E Alright guys, I'll see you later. Say bye, Dalton. Catch you on the flip side of things. Why won't your fucking camera focus? Catch you on the flip side of things.